Hi everyone, welcome to We Draw Studio. Today, we are going to talk about hydrogen. So now let's get straight to it. Hydrogen is the first member of the periodic table. It is located above the alkali metals in the first column. But it's not included because it is so different from them. Hydrogen has the simplest atoms that made of one proton and one electron. It has no neutrons. It is the only element that can exist without neutrons. Hydrogen exists as transparent gas at room temperature. It has a melting point of minus 259.34 degrees Celsius and a boiling point of minus 252.87 degrees Celsius. Hydrogen was first recognized in 1766 by Henry Cavendish, an English physicist and chemist. Cavendish ran an experiment using zinc and hydrochloric acid and discovered hydrogen. He observed that the element produced water when it was burned. In 1783, the element was named hydrogen by the French scientist, Antoine Lavoisier. The name comes from the Greek hydro, meaning water, and genes, meaning forming. Hydrogen is the lightest material in the universe. Pure hydrogen is rare on Earth because it is so light that it eventually escapes into space. When electrified in a glass sphere, pure hydrogen produces a purple glow. At standard temperature and pressure, hydrogen exists as diatomic molecules, H2. It is an odorless, colorless and tasteless gas. It is undetectable by human senses. Hydrogen is highly reactive. It forms compounds with other elements. It reacts violently with the oxygen, chlorine and fluorine. Also, hydrogen is highly flammable. It burns with an almost invisible flame when in contact with oxygen. It could lead to accidental burns. Hydrogen is the most abundant element in the universe. It consists over 90% of all the atoms and makes up 75% of the mass of the universe. Hydrogen is essential for life. It exists in nearly all the molecules in living organisms. Around 10% of the mass of the human body is hydrogen. On Earth, the most common hydrogen compound is water, H2O. Each water molecule contains two hydrogen atoms. Hydrogen is found mostly in stars and gas giant planets too. The Sun, one of the stars, is made up for fifths of hydrogen. Gas giant planets such as Jupiter and Saturn, are vast balls of hydrogen mixed with other gases, such as helium and methane. Today, hydrogen is widely used in many areas. In the Haber process, hydrogen reacts with nitrogen to produce ammonia for making fertilizer. In the hydrogenation process, it is added to thicken liquid vegetable oils. This is used in the manufacturing of products such as margarine and peanut butter. Also, hydrogen is used to produce methanol, which is then converted to methanol, a component for making artificial material like dyes and plastics. Hydrogen is a promising source of clean fuel because the only waste product is steam. Super cold liquid hydrogen is used as rocket fuel to produce a powerful explosion. Hydrogen fuel cells can generate electricity and power vehicles such as car and bus. It is then widely used in forklifts, truck, train, and boat to reduce our dependency on fossil fuels. Because hydrogen-filled balloon is light, it can rise high to collect useful information. It includes atmospheric pressure, temperature and wind speed. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.